Oh my god, you guys. So, I put on some sweatpants, put on a jacket, because my, my package was supposed to be here yesterday. And it wasn't. And I was pissed. So I put on my sweatpants, put on a jacket. I'm like, okay, I'm going to go check the mailbox. And I opened the door. And my package was sitting right there like a Christmas present. Oh my God. My fit tea then came. I can't even open it though. And came in the mail. And I'm super duper excited. Now usually... I'm about to try to use the nail clip. <laughs> now, usually I order the 14-day detox with Fit Tea. However, I've been having like some like little feminine problems or whatever. And I've been I've been vegan since November. And it's what month is it? It's May. Um but like this whole past month yes yeah, and yeah i want to say since about the end of april maybe early may i just been eating all kinds of sugars sweets cake candy every day chips every day oh my god you guys it's so beautiful in there look it so this time I ordered the Fit Tea Super Pack. And it comes with the African Mango Complex Fat Burner. Honey. It comes with the... What's this? For Scolian Boost Metabolism. This little box look a little... I mean, not box, but it's a little dusty. Okay. But it's alright. We're going to... I'm going to ignore the dust follicles. But, uh, okay. It says it boosts your metabolism. I need that in my life. I want to start working out. So, I feel like if I have a boosted metabolism, I... I, I uh, yeah. Whatever. It got that good old Garcinian game boning. Boning. Now, I heard miracles about this Garcinian game boning. I don't know if Dr. Drew... He, um, I don't know if he covered this or not. Whatever. But hallelujah. Hallelujah. Last but certainly not least. Let me tell y'all something. Shut up, Cash. Fit T. When I ordered the 14 day detox, it clears up my psoriasis. I don't really, I take it to get away, get, get rid of the bloating and everything. But I use it for the detox element of it. Because it for real detoxes you. If you use it right, like if you are eating your salads and your raw fruits and vegetables, um, and not drinking sodas as you detox, <laughs> I'm so excited. If you if you use this prop, look at this. I never got a big one. Like I've never. I've always just got the 14 day one. And this this package is huge. I got 28 packs of tea. I'm so excited. Um, yes, I'm like for real excited, y'all. I want to detox. Yeah, my birth okay, so it's May the it's May something. Oh, it's May 20th, it's right there on the computer. It's May the 20th. My birthday is July the 23rd. I'm gonna be 24, y'all. Yes, don't let these baby cheeks fool you. <laughs> the kid is old, I'm gone. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to, you know, shed some weight and stuff. Like these arms used to be muscle. Now they kind of, kind of just like not cute or whatever. And this right here, this ain't it. This is not it. It don't blend well with your makeup. When you got a whole face full of beat and then that double chin pop off in the side pictures like this. Child. Look at that. I can't even do that right. I got to. Listen here, buddy, buddy. I'm excited. I'm good. I cannot freaking wait to get started. I'm, I'm going to start tomorrow, though. I'm not starting today. Because <laughs> I got some rice on the stove right about now. I got some fish out. Uh, and I don't have no fruits and vegetables in my house right now. Because just because my struggle was real this week with my paycheck and 
yeah so when i go to the store today i'm getting lettuce and spinach i probably i probably just get like romaine or whatever maybe green leaf i don't i don't i don't buy iceberg lettuce because y'all know it don't have no nutrition it just is water or whatever <clears throat> so i'm getting spinach lettuce kale i don't know if i'm gonna buy kale at least for the first for the first 14 days i want to stick to completely raw i don't mind that or whatever i can do completely raw for 14 days i've done it before um so yeah so maybe for the first 14 days i'll just buy spinach um lettuce i got i got tons of bananas right now my phone was just telling me it was fully charged um i have mangoes i only have i have two mangoes right now and so i'm buy some more fruit i got a rain check for strawberries uh two for three dollars and strawberries are on sale right now anyway for two dollars so I'm, I'm gonna stock up on like strawberries watermelon is 3.99 right now i'm gonna probably get like two watermelons just for the week then this is what i'm talking about for the week so i'm gonna get like nine packs of strawberries it's like a smoothie and sh stuff or whatever. So like nine packs of strawberries, I'll probably get two watermelon, cantaloupe. I got onions. I like salads. If I'm going to do this raw thing or whatever, I can do salads. So I got to get some, uh, and this is what I like to put in my salad. I like to do, um, cause I don't like a lot of different, like little weird stuff or whatever, like fruits and vegetables. So I pretty much stick with cucumbers, lettuce, spinach, and onion. But recently I've been doing like zucchini and squash, like yellow squash or whatever, so I can like mix it up or whatever. I don't like tomatoes and I think I might be allergic anyway because they have like high in acid and I'm allergic to lemons, straw I mean I'm allergic to lemons, limes, grapefruit. Like I break out. So I'm not doing tomatoes. No. Um, but yeah, the detox really works, y'all. Like if it, it for real works. If you want to cleanse if you have psoriasis i have psoriasis and i have lupus look y'all can tell i have psoriasis and i have lupus so it really like helps with with the cleansing it helps with the with the detoxing it helps with my energy levels because you know when you have lupus you're tired all the time like i'm tired okay like and then i work all the time i have two jobs and just from one job alone, I get like 40 hours a week. So then my other job, and like the 40 hours a week job, I work at night. So during the daytime, I'm working my other job. It's just too much, especially when you have lupus and I don't get a disability check either. Shawty, I need something. Because regardless, I don't think they had this one on my 14 day detox. This thing right here says Garcinia Yamoto. I don't think that was in my 14 day detox. But yeah. I'm not going to read this to y'all. They got it on their website. How to do it and whatever, whatever. With all the ingredients. But. Actually, it says lemon juice on here. And I'm allergic to lemon. But this doesn't break me out at all. Under ingredients, it's. I don't know. It doesn't break me out. I mean, maybe because it ain't a fresh lemon up in here. I don't know. Lemon flavor? No, it can't be lemon flavor. You know when they say lemon flavored, it's artificial. <laughs> this right here is like all natural. It is all natural, guys. And I'm not playing. I'm not hired or nothing like that. Even though I wish I could be. You know, what I, mean? I need some coin. Maybe I can talk to them because I could be like the spokesperson. Honey, I got serious issues. I'm not just trying to lose weight. How am I far? That little, that little fupa. Let me tell you something. They're right here. This gets rid of the fupa, honey. That's why I need it. Because like I, I looked at a picture from last summer when I had the 14 day detox. I Okay, so it's May. I took the 14 day detox in January. I did. And then before that, I took it last summer. And I was showing my mom a video because I was at Charlotte Rue's and I was trying on this little shirt. It was like a crop top or whatever. 
can't show y'all my crop top stomach now because I didn't gain some weight. However, my mom was like, oh my god, I need to go check on that rice. I showed my mom the video. Let me hear you talk. My mom was like, well, yeah, how, how, how you get your stomach like that? That look good. And I was like, honey, I don't know what it was. But then I thought about it. And in preparation for my birthday, I got a detox. And it was like, bam. It was, I was, I'm still a little thickums in the hips and stuff like that. But my little stomach and stuff was little, it was nice and right or whatever. Mm -hmm. So anybody out there that's wondering if, if they should get it. I know, now 28 days is a long time. Okay? That is a whole month to not have nothing. I mean you have stuff or whatever. But now when I went vegan, I went vegan in November and I I I I I, I I didn't know how I was going to stay away from bacon. And that's real life. I didn't know how I was going to stay away from cheese. I mean, I ate cheese like five times a day. You put cheese. And then I. I first, first thing that went was eggs. Because once I realized that eggs was a chicken's period. Oh no 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 no! That's like somebody eating my period. Ooh, make it throw right up. I know. Um, yeah. So I've been doing good with that. You know, I feel really bad. Like I, I st no. Let me. I'm a pescatarian. Let me say that I'm a pescatarian because I still eat shrimp and I still eat fish and salmon. However, um, I don't eat nothing else. And um, I recently had pizza it was a cheese pizza it was freshetta it was freshetta cheese pizza gluten-free crust and then i cut up like peppers and onions on it and that was that was the other day and i'm not gonna feel bad for eating cheese you know i control what i eat and what i don't eat i don't feel bad and i and i do consider myself a, a vegan pescatarian or whatever like that however I had cheese and having cheese for the first time in like seven months it was weird and it didn't really taste like how I remember it tasting I probably won't do it again it I it was no satisfaction I used to love cheese like craft all that little juicy craftiness I probably won't do craft craft probably tastes so weird right now it's just like once you get it out your system you don't want it and you don't miss it honestly you don't and like my mom she goes how do you have a pizza with no meat or how do, like I, I make black bean burgers with like black beans and corn like I make them my own self and my mom's like how do you have a burger with no meat that's just weird that's just nasty I need salads with meat I need chicken in my salad you don't need it you've trained your mind to believe that you want it and you need it and you can't have it whatever oh i don't okay but yeah it it is what it is i feel like if anybody wants to really fully cleanse this up i think you should go vegan i think you should go pescatarian and people sound stupid when they go ew it's vegan food you don't even know what you're talking about it's it's just fruits and vegetables if you just eat fruits and vegetables i mean what's the problem like i don't see what the ill is about you sound dumb anywho I'm super excited i'm gonna start all of my all my christmas presents to myself oh no birthday presents all my birthday presents to myself oh i'm gonna start them tomorrow and i may or may not keep y'all updated hmm i don't know right now i can tell y'all this right now i'm 178 pounds i can tell y'all that and maybe I'll holler at y'all in like a month or whatever. It's going to be hard. It's going to be hard because I like chips every day. I like chips. My favorite chips are anything that end with the O. Tostito, Dorito, Frito. Y'all hear what I'm saying? Did I say Cheeto? Mm-hmm. 
those are my shit right there buddy um i'll let y'all know my progress i'm i want and then i just signed up for a 5k a foam glow 5k in in i mean i'm in bc but i think it's in fort washington yeah i just signed up for that so i need to i need to get fit get toned get motivated to do the right thing in life and just save the animals save the planet shed my fat and slay toothy god sonny um so yeah i think i'll i'll check y'all in in about two weeks to see how i'm doing or whatever i'm just really excited i'm just really excited it's been a whole seven days if y'all wonder how long it took me to get this i ordered it last friday and it just came today hello 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 and then the thing is i ordered friday beef oh my god i really need to go check on my rice bye thank you for watching <laughs>